Hi, welcome to Lunar Logic Tarot. I'm Juju, and this is going to be a general love and life reading for Aquarius. You could have Aquarius in your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Jupiter, and Uranus placements. Um, Aquarius, happy birthday. Welcome to your season. I hope you're enjoying it. I hope you're doing well. Um, but Aquarius, please keep in mind these readings are general, so take what resonates, leave the rest. If it's not your story, do not try to make it fit. Everything is subject to free will and the will of the divine. No one is free from law of cause and effect. And roles can be reversed. What that means is this could be something, you know, that you're doing or going on around you. This could be something your person is doing, going on around them. This could be, you know, a family member, friend, coworker, boss, a neighbor even, something that they're doing or something that's going on in their lives. This could be in your immediate environment, your town, your city, your overall community, and your neighborhood. So please keep that in mind. Um, if you need or want to get a personal reading with me that is tailored specifically to your energy and or your situation, my email is in the description box below. Um, my 50% off on all of my personal readings and sale ends on the 31st. So definitely take advantage of that before it runs out. I'm looking into other ways to do another, another sale for February. Um, I haven't quite decided just yet. Um, also, um, have some other things planned for you guys. Please accept my apologies. I wasn't able to do the freebie Friday for January. I've just been incredibly busy and I just wasn't able to do it this month, but I will have it planned for next month very soon. Um, let's see what else if you need. Oh, also, if there's going to be an extended to this reading, the link to that will be in the description box below, as well as the comment section below. Those are still on sale. Any extended that I do for the month of January are on sale. And I'm also probably going to run, um, something of a special. I haven't decided yet on the extended for February for the month of love. Right. Um, also please stay tuned towards the end of this reading. I will do an Aquarius versus all 12 Zodiac signs. Um, Aries to Pisces. Um, this will be for January 2023. Really, it's just 2023, but we're going to do the cross. So to look at the current situation, the root cause of the situation, the influences, which could be, you know, mental processes, yours, somebody else's. This could be, you know, anybody that you're connected to or your person is connected to. This could be spiritually aspect, environment, anything that's affecting the current situation. We're going to look at the most recent past. Um, which is three months or less, but it could exceed a little bit beyond in the past, you know, past three months, okay, in the past, but not typically, so three months or less. And then we're going to look at the immediate future, um, near future, which will be three months or less, okay? And then I do, they want me to look at your how you feel towards the situation and how, if it's romantic, your person feels towards the situation, okay? So we'll do that towards the end. All right, let's see. All right, Spirit, can you please show me Aquarius? What's going on for Aquarius and love and life, please, Spirit? What's going on for Aquarius and love and life, please, Spirit? Am I taking jumpers? I am. Okay. What's going on for Aquarius? One more shuffle. Aquarius, please. What's going on for Aquarius? What does Aquarius need to know? What's going on for Show me the current situation, please. Okay, we have the Six of Pentacles in the reverse. So that's Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Libra. Okay, so Sixes talk when they're in the upright. They talk about balance, right? In the reverse talks about there's a there's an imbalance here. Okay, you or your person could be, if it's romantic, um, could be giving to other parties. Um, but there's something that's not right here, okay? What is the root cause of this? What is the root cause of this imbalance? Mm -hmm. The five of cups in the reverse. Okay. Loss. Grief. Lack of emotional connection. That's what I just heard. Lack of empathy as well. Lack of um, remorse. Um. Now, Aquarius, I'm not judging you. Um, okay, but y'all can be very detached from your emotions at times, aloof, but not really detached. You feel very much. You feel a lot. You just don't speak on it. You kind of detach from it. You might want to show some of those emotions a little bit, show some affection. What is the influences to this connection, to this situation, please, for Aquarius? Yeah, three of pentacles here. Needing to work together in collaboration, support, supporting one another. If it's romantic, if it's friendships, same thing applies. There's a need to 
getting on the same page is what I just heard, but also needing to collaborate. Okay. This could also be in the workplace. Maybe you're taking on too much work. Maybe work is interfering in your relationship. Okay. Show me the, well, let me get one more. Let me get one more. Give me one more for the influences, please, for this situation for Aquarius. Let me get one more. Okay. The world card. No, excuse me. I apologize. The wheel of fortune in the reverse. Karma is here. Is playing. Working karma. You and your partner, if it's romantic, friendships, family dynamics, business partnerships, you and your partner, if it's romantic, you and somebody else are working, literally working through karma, past karma, right now. With the Wheel of Fortune in reverse, this is working through karma. Interesting. Okay, the most recent immediate past, three months or less for Aquarius. We have the Knight of Wands, so Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This is someone who has a lot of passion, a lot of lust, um, very fast moving. Very ambitious, action oriented. So in the last three months, somebody has had this energy of lust, passion, sexual energy, a get up, a go getter. You know what I mean? Okay. What else is for the recent past for Aquarius? Okay. Four of Pentacles, though. Okay. So somebody holding back their passion. This is the miser. Someone could be also holding back funds from you. You may not know this, but somebody could be hiding money from you, Aquarius. Someone could be squirreling away money for something that you don't know about. Someone could be... Um, Hold on, hold on one second. Okay, sorry about that. So, in the recent past, so three months or less, somebody was moving very quickly regarding funds. But this is also holding back money. But meanwhile, there's a lot of passion, a lot of enthusiasm, a lot of lust. But they're also holding that back as well. Um, I don't know if, you, if this is a business deal. Somebody is not, someone's skimming off the top of its business. If it's romantic, somebody is hiding money from you. And you don't know about it. Okay. Okay, what about the near future for Aquarius? Three months or less? What's coming for Aquarius in the near future? Three months or less? We have the chariot. So that would be um, Cancer, Aries, and Sagittarius. Strong Cancer energy. That's very fast. So the Knight of Wands and the chariot are very... You get you get the chariot, which is very, very fast. You got the Knight of Swords, which is not as fast, but fast. Then you got the Knight of Wands. So you got the Knight of Wands here, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, and then you have the Chariot here, Cancer. So okay, so okay, show me anything else for the near future. Okay, the Magician in the reverse, Virgo, Gemini here. Um, in the near future, Aquarius, somebody here, you're going to find out in three months or less that somebody here has been hiding money from you um, because they are planning and they've possibly been manipulating you as well so they can leave a situation, whether that's a business deal, a, a marriage, a romantic relationship, a family dynamic, a contract. They're holding back a lot with the strength card here, Leo energy. There's a lot you don't know. It's star card reverse. You're not included in this. They're planning on moving forward, Aquarius, but without you. Oh, boy. Um, and they're doing so with, with no regret or no remorse. And they feel like it's karma. How do you feel about this? Let's see. How do you feel about this situation? How does Aquarius actually feel about their person or this situation? How does Aquarius feel? Ace of Pentacles reversed. They feel reject. You feel rejected. 
you're going to feel or you do feel now rejected. Let me move this over a little bit. You feel rejected by your person or the situation. So you're already feeling this energy that your person is about to leave you. You already feel rejected. Okay. You also feel like your person is going to retract their loyalty. If you and your person have money coming in, Aquarius, they plan on taking that money and dipping. Mm -hmm. Whether that's like tax refunds, selling a property, a vehicle, whatever. They quite literally plan on taking that money and leaving. Or you do, because this obviously can be reversed. Somebody is tired of robbing Peter to pay Paul as well. So somebody here is just going to... Oh, that is so messed up. I don't know if you're doing this, Aquarius, or if your person is doing this. But somebody here is planning on leaving the other person high and dry with no money. And they feel like it's justified. Or that is some type of karma here. Although karma is here. But it you don't you and your person don't necessarily have to be working out each other's karma. Or karma that you guys have together. This could be you trying to work out with work things out with someone and them doing this and them creating a massive karmic debt that they have they will have to pay. They don't necessarily have to pay to you. They'll have to pay it, they'll have to experience what you what you experienced. Okay. How does um, Aquarius' person feel about the situation? Queen of Swords reverse. Whew. They don't feel good. They feel vindictive. They feel quite spiteful, um, harsh. They feel like they're lying to you. In fact, they know they're lying to you. Cruel. There's This is cruelty. This is also being intentionally cruel. And meanwhile, you, I mean, take it as it resonates. You know, roles can be reversed, whatever. But I got to read it as I read it. You're feeling rejected in the near future. Or you feel rejected already. This person is doing this intentionally. This person, whomever you're dealing with, Aquarius, they know damn well exactly what they're doing. They have a plan in motion here to quite, they're manipulating you. They're quite literally manipulating you. Let's see what, what is this about? They might even have a new love offer here with the Ace of Wands. That's new romance. That's also a new sexual partner. Okay. Oh, I swear to God, I'm afraid for people to like just stop with this stuff. Sorry, with this stuff. I'm not supposed to cuss on YouTube anymore. All right, why is the Six of Pentacles in the reverse for the court? It's not balanced. Also, too, somebody here might be trying to save up money to give to an attorney if you're married for an divorce. And you don't know. You literally, quite literally, know nothing about what's, what's going on behind your back. This person in the near future, you're going to realize, has man they're telling you they want to move forward. They want to build a future with you, yada, yada, yada. It's all BS. They're manipulating. It's not true. It's not true, Aquarius. They do not want that. They are literally, hold they, have a they have a lusty offer somewhere else or something else that they are chasing. They're also holding back money from you. They're not giving to this connection. They're not showing any empathy. They're, they feel... Like they're very cold and apathetic. I don't know if they're even in love with you. I don't have any. Only cups I have are the five of cups reversed. That's it. I don't even think they're in love with you anymore. But they don't want to admit it. Because then it might spoil this plan. Because I, I'm telling you. They plan on taking money and leaving. As soon as they get a, this check. They cash it. Or deposit it. They're gone. And there, it looks like they're going to leave you high and dry, which is messed up, especially if you're married. Show me the Six of Pentacles reverse, please. Thank you. Wow. Yeah, Six of Swords in the reverse. This is someone who's not truly devoted to, towards you. 
they're not actually they're not with the six of pentacles in the reverse and now we have the six of swords in reverse this is someone who is not trying to communicate fairly with you they're not being fair about the finances with you they're not being equal give and take with you they're quite literally not even trying to move on to karma waters but yet they're telling you that that's what they want that's not what they want they're literally about to to like leave you high and dry with nothing oh boy they have uh, ace of wands at the bottom they have somebody else that they're having sex with period now i have it twice twice wow just tell me more about the six of pentacles reverse six of wands in the freaking reverse three sixes in a row this person does six of wands in reverse is leo energy six of swords in reverse is aquarius energy six of pentacles reverse is taurus virgo capricorn libra this person they may feel some shame about what they're about to do but they're still going to do it anyways they do not want you to see this they do this is when it's, when six of wands is in the upright this is i want to be seen six of wands in the reverse is i don't want you to see this is someone who's hiding their hand and hiding finances quite literally Trust and believe, though, Aquarius, this is going to be one hell of an empty victory for whoever the hell this is. What a shame. Six of Wands reverse, please. I told you, Ace of Wands. They literally are having, they are sleeping with somebody else. And them and this person have concocted this idea that once, ever, I don't know, maybe you sold a house, maybe you're selling a car. Maybe you're selling a contract. I don't know what it is, but whatever it is you're selling, as soon as that money comes in, Aquarius, that the third party and your person, husband or wife or partner are literally going to take that money that's supposed to be half yours and they're going to disappear. That's, that's it. And they're hiding it. Three sixes, all three sixes in reverse. There is a complete imbalance here. There is no equality. There is no fairness here. Your person is 100% doing you freaking dirty behind your back, Aquarius. I'm telling you now, 100% this person is doing some low value, low budget, dirt, low down, dirty dog stuff behind your back. And they plan on completely dipping on you. And they're going to leave you com feeling completely rejected and penniless. Wow. This third party has manipulated them to the point, I feel like it's a Cancer, a Virgo, or a Gemini, to the point that this person now believes the manipulation. But boy, let me tell you, they are in for a rude ass awakening because whoever they're heading towards is actually a gold digger. And they're about to lose more than that. And they're going to lose their... This person's got no... They're morally... and in, they, They're morally spiritually bankrupt. And they have zero integrity. None. Because this is what you don't see. You're not seeing this. With the Six of Wands reverse, you're not seeing this person is quite literally having sex with somebody else. And it's like right underneath your nose and you know it. You know it, Aquarius. Show me the Five of Cups in the reverse. Yep. You're trying to heal a connection that this, with a temperance card, you're trying to heal a connection with somebody who quite literally behind the scenes is planning on abandoning you with nothing and no one. How about that's some hateful, that's some hateful stuff. That's hateful. That is hate. That is hate. Meanwhile, you're over here trying to figure out how the root, the foundation of this, you're trying to figure out how you can heal this because this person is telling you that they want to heal this. This person is working on trying to dish you your karma, but who the hell are they and who do they think they are to try to give you karma? They ain't God. They ain't, they ain't the higher ups. They're truly, they're playing that way and their third party is helping them do it. Yep. When they tell you, they communicate with you with the page of wands and the eight of pentacles reverse saying that they're at work. They're not mm -mm. because the eight of pentacles is in reverse. They're actually not at work. Mm mm. They're out being reckless. Mm -hmm. Wow. Wow. <sighs> you, 
you need to check the finances, all of it. You need to go through all the accounts. If you're married to this individual, do not sign a dang thing. I don't I mean that do not sign anything without proper legal representation. You if this is a marriage, you're going to need a barracuda. You're going to need someone who is bloodthirsty because who what they're doing, you're going to have to hire a private investigator to find these people because they literally just dipped out on money that half of it actually belongs to you. And I don't even think it matters about that, honestly, because it's more so about the principle. You've got Gar Archangel Gabriel coming here trying to bring you some type of balance and peace here, but it's not working. You know, Aquarius, that something big is going on behind your back. You know it's big. You can feel it. How many major arcanas have we got? One, two, three, four. We have four major arcanas. Fours represent stability and protection. You do not feel safe. You do not feel stable right now. You know something's up. But you can't quite put your finger on it. But you know something's wrong. You know something's wrong. Show me this five of cups. You're trying to heal this connection with somebody who quite literally does not care. Like zero. Does not care. They're just waiting for money. For this whatever money is coming in. So they can quite literally disappear. Wow. Wow. If this is your story, your window of time is running very short. You need to go to the bank like tomorrow. Tomorrow, you need to go to the bank. Tomorrow. Man or woman, I don't care who you are. You need to go to the bank and you need to you need to look at all the accounts. You need to sit down with a financial advisor and you need to say, I need to see all the accounts. And I need to see the accounts that I may not have access to. And I need to know why right now. Tomorrow, like you see this reading, it's going to be live tonight, which is the 30th. Tomorrow morning, 8 a.m., the 31st, you need to be there when the bank opens. Do not, do not wait on this. Do not wait on this. Shit, I might do it to myself. Shit, this is scary. Five of Cups reverse. Yep, star card reverse. Listen, this is your card, Aquarius. You are quite literally trying to heal something with someone. And they are... Now, for some of you Aquarians with the star card reverse, this could be you doing this. You could be the one planning this. Which I have to say is messed up. Is messed up. If, if Aquarius, I got to call it. If you're the one who's doing this, Aquarius... I want you to know that's messed up, okay? I'm just saying. If you're skipping out with a third party with a large sum of money, that's messed up. But I don't feel like it's you. But it could be. I mean, you know, roll, take it as it resonates. But with the star card reverse, it's like you don't see this. You quite literally don't see this coming when this happens, you're thinking, okay, we're healing everything. We're going to balance everything out together. You really don't have a lot of time. You got less than three months, probably less than two. You don't have a lot of time to foil the plan because you need to. You need, you see the king of swords in the upright at the bottom of the deck. That is Aquarian energy, whether you're a man or a woman. This is a lawyer. This is the courts. This would be a judge. This would be a cop. Or an investigator. Wow. Um, I got a weird message here. This may not be for everybody. Do not sign any life insurance. If you're married and your, your partner, your husband or your wife comes to you saying, we have this new life insurance plan I want us to sign up for. Don't just willy-nilly sign everything. You need to sit there and look at it. You need to see what the details and don't sign nothing for the next three months. Don't sign nothing for the next three months. Sign nothing. Don't don't sign anything because I feel like you you there's something else. If you know, if, I hope you can pick up what I'm putting down there. There's something else going on with that. That's just like a side message. I don't feel like that's for everybody. 
Yeah, Page of Pentacles here. This person's saying, I'm offering you healing with the Page of Pentacles. I'm offering you apologies. I want to work things out with you. Let's whatever, whatever. But it's a page level. It's a page. It's not a king. It's not an emperor. It's not a queen. It's not an empress. It's a page. It's a page. This person is literally giving you the bare minimum, breadcrumbing you just long enough to get whatever they got, this deal, this money, whatever's coming in, so they can leave with a third party. So, you, and then they won't ever speak to you again. Like, somebody here, like, it feels like this person, like, I hate to say it this way, but, they, like, they really are, like, either they really hate your guts or this third party hates your guts. Like, I'm not even kidding you. Show me the three of pentacles, please. Like, meanwhile, you're trying to work on something. And this part, they're working on trying to deliver you some type of bad karma. This person and this third party, because that's what I'm getting here, are trying to work together. And this is talks about support and collaboration. They're working in cahoots to try to deliver you some type of dose of bad karma. When in reality... You've probably been the only loyal one to this person, this shyster, ever. Wow. All right. Show me three of pentacles. It's so ridiculous. Yep. Yep. Look, ten of swords in the reverse. This person that is working to try to deliver you karma has stabbed you in the back more times than you can count on all of your ten, all ten fingers and toes. Really? They, psh, wow. That's, they're working on the ultimate portrayal. That's what they're doing. Your person and their third party, whomever, are in cahoots to work on a very nasty, painful, ultimate portrayal towards you. Man. What is wrong with people? We do have Pluto retrograde in Aquarius right now. Just letting you know, Aquarius. Shit, I might go to the bank in the morning my damn self. Shit. Show me three, three of pentacles. Yep, five of cups. They're even telling you, let's work things out. I'm sorry for betraying you. I have remorse and regret, yada, yada, yada it's it's a show they're putting on a show for you it, they're, it's not true it's a show wow the audacity show me the will of fortune reverse the world card in reverse it's not it's it, it, it will come back for, they think that it's not going to come this this is the type of person who doesn't believe in karma this is the type of person or people who don't actually believe in karma or they're so arrogant enough to actually believe that they are above karma or maybe even above God. You got some, you got a couple people here that got like a God complex. Like, I'm not even kidding you. That they, they think that they can outrun God or the divine, whatever you resonate with. They think that they're above, above the divine. They think that they're above God. And that they're the arbiter of your karma and your destiny. <laughs> Show me this Wheel of Fortune reverse. Tell me more. Wow. Yep. Eight of Swords in the upright. You know. This card talks about, I know. This is like someone being bound, right? She's bound. She's got eight swords around her. You know the truth. It's literally right underneath your nose. They're doing it in broad daylight. Like it's happening right before your eyes. But you're you were in a blindfold. You know something's going on. You feel it. You know something's wrong. You know something big is coming. You know something is seriously wrong. Do not sign any documents. I'm telling you right now. No life insurance. No, no legal documents. Don't you sign your name on nothing without an actual legit license like loan like a shark of attorney like they got to be a white shark like a like you know like a, a you know like a big shark you know you can, you're gonna need a monster of, a, of an attorney because you're gonna need somebody who's gonna be able to go in there and like shred everything like 
I'm telling you now, that's what you're going to need with this type of situation because you got people here that are so, like this is despicable type of people. Whether you're married to them or not, I don't care how long you've been with them. If they're gonna, if they're planning to do this, mm -mm, mm -mm, you know something's wrong. They're trying to keep you feeling bound. They want to keep you secure, feeling like everything's gonna work out. You, your spouse is gonna be fine. Yada yada yada. Everything's gonna be great. Y'all gonna work out, work through your issues, whatever, whatever. You're thinking maybe you're getting some hope back. Maybe they're telling you they got hope back, but in reality, it's just to keep you. To pacify you because behind the scenes this is all what's going on so you don't find out six of pentacles in the reverse again you are being juggled 100 percent wow with a queen of cups in reverse who's cancer pisces who is beyond unloving and nurturing this person is the epitome of a manipulator, an emotional manipulator and a gold digger. And that's who your person who did not put up proper boundaries with is choosing to go for. Well, oh, they're in for a big surprise. They're in for a very big surprise, unfortunately. But this is this is going to be a, like a shock to the system. I, I mean, this is wow. Show me. Let's look at this Knight of Wands in the most recent past three months or less. Um, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, very passionate, very lusty here. They're holding back money. I'm telling you right now, they're also being very greedy. Like the miser is someone who's greedy. This is someone who's very stingy and greedy as well. And behind that is the nine of wands. They're also lusty and got passion for someone else. This is someone who is, they're doing the most. This is someone who runs the streets. This is somebody who will sleep with anything that will take them like quite little they have no real standard they have no real morals they may claim that they do but in reality the knight of wands is nowhere near a king and most definitely isn't an emperor who is the husband and the father they mm -mm. no they don't got they don't let some 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 side chick some side piece some side dude done get in their head and done scramble their brains a little bit that's what's happened <laughs> but they're in for a rude awakening okay yeah yeah look page of swords reverse this part man listen listen <laughs> i'm not it's not funny but this is like i'm i'm laughing because i'm nervous because this is the type of reading that people go to prison over like i mean like the, well, not the reading but when people do this kind of stuff they're begging to go to prison you know what I mean? Because this is like, this is scams. This is something, you be careful of people scamming you. Your person could, your your partner, your spouse, husband, wife could actually be, actually be getting robbed of all their money, y'all's money, because they don't think that this third party done loved them and everything, then fell in love with them. Let's run away together, whatever, whatever. Yeah, moment they get gone, that part, your person maybe, I don't know, gets drunk or something, they get a hold of the cash, poof, they're gone and now they're left out with the cash and you and then you're left is this is a big mess with but with the page of swords reverse this knight of wands is not only knight of swords or excuse me the page of swords reverse is somebody who stalks spies this is someone who will lie to you this is someone who is petty defensive arrogant as well this is also someone who spreads malicious slander and one like hellacious uh gossip about you malicious gossip so you got your person is even like gossiping about you to anybody with ears especially this third party like anything that you aquarius listen i want you to be very careful going forward from after you hear this reading anything that you say to your partner whether when you're around them they're telling the third party immediately i want you to know that right now anything when your partner's not around you your partner and they're with that third party they're putting it on mute and both of them are listening to you speak be mindful of your tongue be mindful of your words i'm telling you right now be careful of anyone recording your voice be careful of anyone like i'm telling you there's there's some there's some shicey stuff going on right here show me this nine of wands reverse liar bad liar yep nine nine of wands reverse this this person is extremely petty extremely deceptive and has zero boundaries 
And they're, wow, they're falling for the hokey doke. Hook, line, and sinker. They don't fell for it. And they're about to run off with all y'all's money. And then they're going to get robbed. And then they're going to want to come back. Wow. Okay. Show me the four of pentacles, please. Be mindful of your tongue, please, though. Yeah, five of pentacles. This is what they're doing. They're trying, they're holding back money to leave you desolate. This is some five of pentacles is somebody being left desolate, but not a, not a penny to their name. You need to start saving up money away from your partner immediately, immediately, immediately. Cause they've been doing it for months. They might've been doing it for a whole year. They've been doing it. You need to start doing it immediately Aquarius, because I'm telling you right now, if you don't, you're going to be sorry because this person right here, I mean, you do whatever you want, but like my nose is itching like crazy. My ears are ringing. I'm telling you right now, this person is going to do this. They're about to do this. You need to start saving up some money because this person is about, they're about to do it. Yeah. Injustice in reverse. Massive injustice about what they're doing. Yeah. Strength card in the upright. This person is literally holding back everything that they said that they would give you because they're giving it to a third party and they plan on screwing you out of everything. And leaving you holding the bag for everything. If y'all got kids, they plan on leaving them behind too. They plan on leaving those kids behind too. Wow. Karma's going to catch up with them though. Ooh, now it's in the upright. And justice too. Yeah, you ain't going to. They they're not going to be able to escape this. Mm -mm. Wow. That's crazy. Show me uh, four of coins, please. Yep, look, eight of wands in the reverse. They're not communicating to you a lot, right? And they're acting really suspicious, right? They're extra defensive, right? Maybe they're even depressed or agitated. You know why? Because they're guilty. This is the nine of swords is guilty. They're not opening up to you emotionally, not because of anything you did. It's because they don't want to spill the tea. They don't want to give it away because they know they're guilty. Yeah they are again juggling you wow this is crazy this is like a whole conspiracy here <sighs> show me the chariot knight of uh pentacles in the reverse i'm telling you when they do this if you don't stop them beforehand that part your person's gonna lose or maybe it's you who's doing this i don't know aquarius whomever's the one who's doing this they're going to get robbed by the third party too. Wow. Also, this talks about disloyalty. So if they're, I'm telling you, this person has no intentions of moving forward with you in the future with the magician in the reverse here. And the they're manipulating you. And the, then the third party is manipulating them. And this is talks about extreme dislo disloyalty and also greed. Wanting something without working for it. Wanting it immediately. Th this is going to happen quicker than what you think it's going to happen. You need to go to the bank tomorrow. Yeah, five of swords in the reverse. You're going to catch the manipulate. If you're lucky, I hope that you are. You'll catch it in time. You're going to catch the manipulation. You're going to catch it. You're, you're probably already feeling it already that something's really, really wrong. But you're not quite sure because they've been gaslighting you. You know, you've been gaslit like to smithereens. Okay. I'm not talking crap. I'm not, I'm, I'm being serious. That's what's happening. Yep. You need, mm -hmm, you need a lawyer that taught, that will pass judgment on this. That's what that is. Or this is you. Male or female doesn't matter. Aquarius. Okay, King of Swords, you're going to catch this right at the right time before it actually takes place. And you're going to be like, all right, this is what you had planned the whole time? This is what you're going to do the whole time? Okay, my final decision is no, we can split everything. If you want out so damn bad, then let's go through the process. None of this skipping town kind of crap. Oh, Lord. Show me the Magician Reverse. They're going to... Oof. They are guilty. Yeah. Queen of Swords. It could be a Gemini. Libra as well. Or this could be you. 
Like maybe this is you, right? And this could be your attorney, right? Or the divine's calling judgment on the situation on the masculine's part, okay? Somebody here, there's a woman here that's that's very manipulative. You are in the upright though, although your person feels like you're not. You know the truth. You know they're manipulating you. Show me the magician reverse. You know they're manipulating you. You know they are. Yep, Ver, the hermit card in reverse. They don't want you to go within. You know what I'm saying? This person has repeated mistakes of the past, and you know it. You know it, Aquarius. You know the truth. Wow. How you feel about it, you're going to feel rejected. Show me the Ace of Pentacles reverse. Yeah. You're like, all right, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get all this back plus some. I'm gonna, I, you're gonna be racking up some karma, like in a kind of a good way, because what, how egregious this is. This is a whole plot. This is a whole scheme. Wow. Show me how you're. Now this is how this is how your person feels about you or the situation. Very cold. Very apathetic. Very dishonest. This very manipulative. Also very, very malicious and vindictive. They are very, they feel very entitled to me. Show me the Queen of Swords verse. Yeah. For very stubborn. They don't want to hear anything about it. Like they, mm -mm. yeah. But they do, they feel like you're very stubborn. And that you, but they do see you as the Empress. They're going to dip out on the family. If y'all got kids together... They're going to disappear, Aquarius. After they get this money, they're going to just vanish. Wow. With this third party. And then the third party is going to rob them. And then the third party is going to vanish with all the money. Your person, though, doesn't want to communicate a lot because they feel so guilty. They are guilty. They're guilty of sin about this. Like, they know it. They know it. Wow. This was wild. I don't know who's, this is very specific, but please protect yourself, okay? Don't sign nothing. Protect yourself financially, legally as well, please. Um, you need to, it seems like, because this is, um, it's crazy. Um, it's wild. Okay, let's see. Oh, I don't want to use this. I mean, abs that's absolutely wild. Okay, really? No, I don't want to use that either. Mm, let's see okay all right let's do your all 12 zodiac signs and then i am going to go to the extended because i want to see just what else is going to come out of this wild maybe it's a movie you're watching i don't know all right Spirit, please show me aquarius versus all 12 zodiac signs please aquarius versus all 12 zodiac signs please you need to protect yourself okay like now like right now Show me Aquarius versus all 12 zodiac signs. Thank you. Here we go. They could be going somewhere like near the ocean. Like near a beach or something or California. I don't know why I heard California. But California. Or Oregon. That's interesting. Oh, sorry, I have my elbow. So if you're done with the Aries, Hawk, keen eyesight, observation, and watching. You need to watch this Aries, Aquarius, or they're watching you. Now, for some of you, Aquarius, this is you, and you got an Aries watching you. And be like, what are you doing? You know what I'm saying? If you're dealing with a Taurus, coffee bean, snooze, wake up, call, fresh start. There's a Taurus that could be doing this too, okay? We do have the Empress that came out. You need to wake up, okay? If you're dealing with a Gemini, scissors, cutting ties, sever cut cutting ties and sever ties there could be a gemini who's doing that that also came out as well um if you're dealing with a cancer snake deception and lies this cancer is a liar aquarius and you know it this could be the third party this cancer could be the third party aquarius that's lying and very deceptive to your person about you and your person it could be lying to you about this third party or this cancer is the one who's coming up with a scheme they're a snake 
they're a snake. This Cancer is a snake, straight up. Oh, Lord. Okay, if you're dealing with a Leo, skull, death, cycle, end. Yeah, there's a Leo that's about to end things with you very abruptly. Like, I'm telling you, it's coming. It's coming based on lies and deception. If you're dealing with a Virgo, lion, pride, ego, and strength. This Virgo's got too much ego, too much pride. They're, why? Why? Yeah, they're lying or they're they're lying or they're too egoic in the in the in the connection. Okay, if you're dealing with a Libra, locked door, impenetrable block blockage is closed off. This Libra is blocked off right now. I feel like they might be hiding something, but not necessarily. They could be maybe worried about something, but they're not really communicating with you right now. If you're dealing with a Scorpio, Rose, charming, romantic proposal, an apology. There's a Scorpio that wants to apologize to you, Aquarius, for something. Maybe they, this already happened. I don't know. If you're dealing with a Sagittarius, Aquarius, leather belt, tied down, restricted, and boundaries. This uh, this Sagittarius is putting up boundaries with you. They feel trapped by you, Aquarius, or you feel trapped by a uh, Sagittarius. If you're dealing with a Capricorn, crystal pendant, it says divine guidance, spiritual answers, and intuition. If you're done with a Capricorn, you need to listen to your intuition, or they need to listen to their, listen to their intuition about you. If you're done with another Aquarius, or this is you, lipstick, flirt, infidelity, evidence. You could be the one who's cheating and you could be the one planning to dip out. Or Aquarius, your person is definitely cheating and you're finding evidence of that and they are dipping out with money. If you're dealing with the Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, mirror, reflection, mirroring, self-awareness. This Pisces is broken. Like they're also, they don't know how to self-reflect very well. They're mirroring to you what you want to see. What else? Or what your person wants to see. Tools, fix, repair, rebuild, construction. This person is telling, this Pisces is telling you that you guys can fix things. Or you and your per, you, you know, maybe this is the third party telling your person that. Go try to fix things. So make, so she's not suspicious or he's not suspicious. What else? Smoke, grenade, sabotage, explosion, and smoke. Yeah, you're not, there. Mm -mm, you're not seeing something clearly about a Pisces and your person. Or this is your person. Yeah, water, emotions, uh, feelings, and re replenish. Yeah, your person is very thirsty for this Pisces, or this Pisces is very thirsty for you. But somebody here is thirsty, but they're not thirsty for you. And there's a lot of smoke and mirrors here. I got smoke and mirror. What else? Yeah, smoothing over, butter up. Yeah. Okay. This Pisces is either trying to butter you up to get you to be calm and not suspect anything, or... Or they're trying to get your person to butter you up because they're the third party in order to make this plan go out flawlessly. Yep, they want to keep your 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 vision limited so you don't see it. This Pisces does. Yeah, competition, games, and foolery. Yep, it's the third party. Wow. Ooh, Lord. It's probably one of the most important readings I've done in a while. Well, I mean, all my readings are important, but this is like... Yo, pay attention, like, right now. Like, wow. Very important. All right, let me get some guidance. Guidance, please, for Aquarius regarding this reading. Um, In the extended, I'm going to get the rest of the tea here. We're going to find out. Ex we're going to get We're gonna get it. We're going to get it in the extended, okay? The link to that extended will be in the description box below and in the comment section below. Guidance. And it says prosperity lies ahead. You do have money coming in regardless of whatever they're doing or not doing, whatever. Yeah, your commitment, your relationship, maybe even your marriage is being tested right now. And it feels like your person, if this isn't you, Aquarius, your person is hook, line, and sinker falling for the oldest, the oldest scam in the world. Attention. A pretty woman, pretty girl, whatever giving them some attention lust they're falling for it hook line and sinker hook line and sinker or man whatever hook line and they're falling for charm they're falling for charm yep nothing is set in stone yet but they have talked about it they're working up the plan if they haven't already started to exact it yeah you need to show the world who you really are and how smart you are and nothing gonna get by you boo boo ain't nothing gonna get by you Mm -mm. yeah luck is on your side but I'm, your emotions are running high they will be running high but i'm gonna need you to keep it calm okay yeah wow that's crazy okay aquarius i'm gonna take into the extended 
holy smokes, go to the bank, talk to an attorney ASAP, okay? Please, you ain't got to listen to me, but just think about it. Let's just see what signs you're dealing with, though. What signs are involved in this crazy stuff? What signs are involved in this? It could be a Taurus or an Aquarius. We got Aries. We got Capricorn. We have Cancer, of course. We have Sagittarius. Pisces, of course. I mean, that was pretty bad. Virgo. A Gemini. Okay, I'm surprised by that one. You. It could be you too, Aquarius. Okay. Okay. Libra. Taurus. Hell, it could be anybody. It could be anybody. I don't have Scorpio here, though. So, it could be anyone. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. You just, please protect yourself, please. Don't get, don't get, don't get suckered, okay? Because that would be bad, okay? All right, well, Aquarius, I love you so much. Um, foil their plan. Foil it. Make them work for it. This is crazy. Cra this is a, such a crazy reading. All right. Well, I love you. Take care of yourself. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. Link to the extended is below. And in the comment section, I will talk to you later. Bye.